my friend Jean-Serge Gagnon so today is going to be about Click eCourse hosting your own course on Click eCourse it's a site I've been working on for a long time and today we're going to do a short intro on to how to host your course on Click eCourse we're also going to show you why Click eCourse why would you want to use Click eCourse host over those other big name sites out there and we're going to show you the kinds of things that we do on Click eCourse that those sites don't do or that they do differently but click eCourse why click eCourse why would you want to use that site over those other sites and we're going to show you how to how to host a course how to set up your course where you need to put files what you need to do and we're also going to talk about the affiliate programs and how to generate income from your course on click eCourse and what else you can do to generate income using click eCourse so that would be why you would want to host a course we're going to show you how to do that how to sell your course and how all that works all right so we're going to talk about that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets all right so why click eCourse first of all let's talk about your course what is your course what do you what did you create you got a course you got a topic you got something you're trying to teach you got something you want others to hopefully buy right so maybe maybe it's a course you want to sell maybe it's a course you just want to host as a freebie to get people on your list really either one is fine with click eCourse we're going to show you how to do that right now Oh, wrong screen I'm touching the wrong screen hold on let me move that out of there and share my screen here it comes and I moved it so let me just reorganize it right there all right so when you go to clickecourse.com you're going to get to this site so this is what click ecourse uh, site looks like so clickecourse.com you're going to come to this site and you're going to be able to see uh, some like you know marketing blurb a sales a sales information on on the site what the site's about what can you do on the site um as basic so we're going to start by creating an account so you know the the process to host your course is the same as pretty much any other site you got to create an account the accounts are free you can set up a free account you can host a course for free you don't have to pay anything you don't have to give us any money to sell your course either and so if you want to look at the plans there are some different plans for advanced features or more courses if you want to host more courses or you want to host longer videos longer courses more lessons all that it's all detailed in the plans we're, we're going to show you that in a bit first let's just show you how to register an account you click on the register link on the top right there and then you just put in an email address so let's just say we uh, we will put in a uh, host test and I'm just going to create a new account here put a new password and that's it so you just put your email address <clears throat> obviously it has to be a correct email address I'm just going to copy this and then you click on the register button by the way you can see right here it says you were referred by that's one of the things about the affiliate program we have on Click eCourse it's cookie based so as soon as somebody goes to Click eCourse using your link they're going to be shown as being referred by you instead of me and that's going to stay in their browser so if they visit the site through google searches or they go to the directly to the site they're still referred by you until they sign up once they sign up you own any commissions you would get from that particular referrals right so get them on there get them to have a free account so that they're tied to you so you get the commission on them anyways that's enough about the affiliate let's just talk about the course so once you uh, hosting a course once you click the register button you will get this pop-up uh it'll say account created please check your email uh this just I'm just gonna put all these in there um and then that's it so you know now we're we're registered our account is registered if I was to try to register again actually I've never even tried that let's see what happens I haven't tried registering again I know I might have I click on register email already in use okay so try to log in instead so if I try to log in instead 
now it's going to give me a message saying your email is new and needs activation so if you ever don't get the email you can click here to request a new activation link again right or get the activation link email again <clears throat> and close all these okay so now if I go to my email let's just go to my email here hopefully I will have received it already let's just take a look once you get the email you're going to get an email like this it's going to look like this you can say welcome to click eCourse you or someone else requested an account and if you did not you can just ignore this email and activation link will expire after two days or you may let us know to delete the account so however if you did request the account you are a simple step away from receiving access here's the link and you just click that link and that logs you in and it activates your account so now it says successfully activated your account now you've got an account all right you've got an account you want to create a course on here now if you're going to be selling a course on on Click eCourse you probably want to set up your account to be to look a little professional right so what and you probably want to get commissions as well if anybody else sells if you sell anybody else's course or you promote the actual membership site uh, membership um, uh, you want to set up your account to be to receive all that so what we're going to do is we're going to go to the profile which is just your picture here it's just a little picture we're actually going to go here and we're going to create a we're going to actually choose a profile picture I'm just going to go into my <coughs> images here and I'm just going to use a profile like uh, I don't know let's use this one this one here which obviously you want to have a profile picture with yourself I'm going to put my display name is this is a test account and I'm going to change my username to test tester right just to tester my first name is test and my last name is account and this and I'm going to put a bio in here I'm going to say this is a test account please ignore it anyway so this will <laughs> this when I click on the save it'll upload the picture and it'll change my um <coughs> my profile my my display name all that stuff so you can see right here that now I have the image and over here that image is there and I can see that it's a test account it's tester and if I go to um now if I create a course it'll show that obviously you don't want to have a name called test account right but um if you create a course it'll be tied to that and people will be able to see that we'll show you in a second how that works so let's just say now that you want to create a course you can click on the little plus here click on the course you want to create a new course you just click on that I have to fix this error whatever that error is I'll take a look but anyway so right now you give it a title I'm going to say this is a test course I'm going to say I am testing the platform in a course income secrets episode and then in the details I can add a whole bunch of things in there there this is the details details of the course don't forget about a b and c and see you can get a at and b at and c at <clears throat> right so now more more text here so now I just click on next over here <clears throat> and in SEO you can use SEO search engine keywords you can say uh, test course I can say uh, testing click e-course I can say uh, weight loss I can say course hosting so whatever you want to put as keywords right that's SEO keywords and the hashtags is similar to that now what we're going to, going to do we're just going to the header code we're going to leave blank you don't need to put anything in there by default obviously uh we click on next the categories is where you would organize this affiliate marketing it's also email list building it's also lead generation it's um I don't know uh, online strategies it's is there a course course creation right there okay so I'm going to just do that 
click on next if you want oh by the way you can always go back <laughs> and you can go you can also go straight to the actual section you want if I go straight to SEO I can click on the SEO hash right there it takes me there straight there I can just click on categories as well to go to categories cover image that kind of stuff but what I wanted to show you was that in categories if you don't find the course category that you want to that you want to use in the category which you probably you, there's not that many right you just put in here this is a test course and you just say next and it'll add that and I believe let me see I, I don't remember it's been a long time since I did that but let's see if that works uh it might not I'm not sure but I'm going to say test testing and test test uh course let's see I don't know if the comma I forget there's a there's um, there might be a way to do that with multiple categories or maybe not maybe that didn't work I guess it doesn't like that okay so that's fine so you just put a one category click next you go back to categories you want to add more than one and that's kind of how it works then a uh, cover image you just click on choose file again we're just going to use this image here and we're going to just click on, on next and um it's loading it's saving the image uh, my internet's not super fast so now what you want to do is you want to put a price here you want to put a higher price here and then you want to use uh, deals to give them a lower price so you don't want to put the the current price on there so let's say you want to sell this for I don't know uh 997 but it's really a three thousand dollar course you're going to put 29.97 right here and that's that's the price you put there the next thing is the commission the commission percent is how much percentage of the sale do you want to give away to whoever else promotes your course if it's not you right if it's somebody else that sells it how much do you want to give it to them I'd say depending on the course and depending on what your business model is you might give them 20 percent 30 percent 50 percent even a hundred percent if you're trying to build a business online you're trying to just generate leads and get people to 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 <laughs> to um get add people added to your list you could give a hundred percent of the commission and that's what I like to do I use I like to use a hundred percent and I want to give the commission to anybody you can choose to give it to just paid members or buyers of their course so you could have somebody can't get a commission and sell your course unless they buy it so you can do that here too by setting that what's uh, what's the next thing so next is the whether it's downloadable or not you can choose whether people can download your mp3s or your videos and that's really only applicable if you have a paid plan because on the free plan you can't upload your videos on the site it's only YouTube links so that means they already have access to it anyways by just clicking on the, on the YouTube link right but uh yeah so that's there <coughs> under embedded player again that's the same thing use embedded videos means that it will show the YouTube link or the Facebook link or the Vimeo link and again this is not something that should be uh that's not relevant to a free account it's only on the paid plans that you can choose to disable that uh so that's well so that's not relevant to free access then under access is where you set what people can do with your course right if they can if they can see your course or not in the course list we'll show you that in a second uh basically uh, do you want it it's a new course while you're developing it while you're not ready you just leave it on new course later on you can change that under sales is the ability to choose a sales page name so you could have slash test course and then you could you could create your own html structure and everything and create a zip file and this is very advanced so we'll just skip this for now under sites it's where you choose to host your course elsewhere we have a lot of sister sites online course repo online course directory free online course repo master of simple uh, click eTeach click eLearn click vclass even f or online uh, Facebook 10 step bot all those are sister sites of Click eCourse they're basically use the same framework but you can host your course on there as well if you want I usually just choose them all uh, the only thing is it'll give me a message that free online course repo you can't use for your if your course has a price on it it'll just tell me right here it'll say updated updated and now we get to the course page so this is the course page you can see the text the test we put test course we put I am testing the platform and this is the details right you can see all that right here now that's the course uh, page that is available to you as the creator of the course you can see all this here 
can choose a deal like I was saying let's let's give us a deal of 997 I want to make it 997 from uh, from the this from right now let's let's back it up because it, it gives us a few uh, so zero one and then we're going to do on uh, the let's say 12 31 right so I mean obviously you might want to do, do these deals that don't last as long as this so that people look uh, for um, urgency right but you know we can just do this we'll just add that for now and then when we uh <coughs> oh actually I should just reload the page right here and now you can see that it says that it's 997 with 66 percent off until the certain date right so that's just the price now this is just what people will see they don't see any of this stuff obviously they don't see the edit course thing they don't see these buttons down here all that's for you as the course creator so now the next thing you want to do is you want to add a lesson so you go in here plus you put, press the little plus next to lesson. oh you know what the other thing you can do or I'm not sure if that's let's go back to the course here let's cancel down the bottom go back to the course I don't know if I've enabled that yet yeah right here so under let you can click on the plus here and say lesson right there I want to add a lesson to this course <clears throat> so that takes me to the lesson course this is lesson so introduction so learn what learn what this course is all about right um, the, the the introduction will tell you tell you what to expect and of course you can put text in there that actually you know is an introduction right you don't have to to do that so then the next thing is you have to put a url right here so if I go to my youtube <coughs> this is kind of how you would do it you would go to your channel under youtube you would go to to your channel my channel right and videos <clears throat> and then you just take one of these videos let's say well let's just say I'm actually going to go to my YouTube studio right <clears throat> and what I'm going to do is I'm going to videos and I'm going to search for specific things I'm going to search for TikTok because I have done some TikTok videos right is it not loading TikTok oh okay I want to do that I want to go to videos and then I want to search for TikTok and I want to see whoops that's not what I want what's it doing TikTok show all there we go <coughs> okay so these are all the videos that I did with TikTok I guess so here's some short videos right here so this is a one minute video obviously these so say I had a bunch of little videos I wanted to put in the course like this I would go in here I would just say copy get shareable link I go back into here and I paste that right here and I just save it and now I have a video in the course and it'll also go and get me the thumbnail for it as you can see right here it goes and gets well it yeah so now I have this let's just add another course another video if I go back to the course here I can click on add new lesson right there too if you want right but let's just uh, you can click on the plus here to add a lesson or this plus and then lesson right there <coughs> uh, let's do a second lesson this is recording right so how to record how to record and you know obviously you put the right text in there because that and you'll see how that all fits in a second I'm just going to go back to my YouTube channel I'm going to go into whoops it's my blog post right there my YouTube channel right here I'm going to go to a timer recordings again I go here get shareable link go back into here and then paste it in the URI right there and I save it now if I go back to the course and by the way you don't have to wait for that it'll it works in the background <clears throat> the only difference is that if you don't wait for it and you load the page you might not see it right here actually I think I did the same the same video but here's the thing so once I have these I can I don't have to publish them right away but I want to publish these right now I'm just going to click on publish the other option is you could adjust um 
you could have just enabled the the course as a publish when you're editing the course or when you're creating it uh, let's go back to the list here uh, this one here as you can see is red it means it's not published yet I can just edit this and in here I can set the status to published right there right I'll save that okay so now I have a course with two lessons in it obviously you might want to have more you would want to have probably more lessons but the lessons are basically just videos in the course right that's that's the basic very basic kind of course that you can create on Click eCourse but over here you can see that these are ready and the course is not yet published it's not yet published I'm going to just going to go and publish the course uh, by just editing it whoops edit right here <coughs> right here <coughs> and then I'm just going to go into this course I'm just going to go here under access and I'm going to set it to public right here I'm just going to set it to public and then go okay and done so now this course is public it's a test course obviously if somebody sees it but if I go to courses right here click on courses <coughs> now you'll see this course in in the page we're going to go through this these are all the courses on the site you see this test course is right here we're going to see the image in a second the time it takes to load is I guess my internet is a little slow today but yeah so this is the course right here if I was to go on this link here in an incognito window somebody would see this uh this this is what they would see when they tried to access it <clears throat> they would see that it's 997 they would see the two lessons and they would see these unlock course buttons if you click on unlock course <clears throat> it takes you to the page where you can actually get lifetime access to this course for 29.97 well actually it's supposed to say 997 I gotta fix that yeah so but if I click on that it takes me to PayPal to order that where yeah I gotta fix that it's not the right price but that's so that's what happens when you when somebody goes to your course and clicks on the button to get it right <clears throat> so how do other people promote your course right so here let me just show you the other thing what else can you do is you can promote this course if you're an, a person who's got an account if I go for example to uh, let's just see if I go to log in as myself on here I'll log out and then I log in as myself yep my my real account and I go to this course here <clears throat> if I go to the course now <coughs> excuse me <coughs> where is it there's the test course right here if I go to that course now you can see that the course says it become an affiliate and get 997 commission on the sale which is because the course commission I set to 100 percent right so that's why you can get a hundred percent I should probably put a percentage there uh, commission on the sale and that allows others to promote the course so what you do as me as the uh, I can just promote this course here by going to I can send people to jsg.clickycourse I can send them to that link if I open this link up in incognito do I have the incognito let's close this let's go here new incognito window go there now that automatically redirects it saves a cookie as me being the person who promoted it if it's you it would be you and if I click on register right here you'll see that it says that yeah, I was referred done by me obviously that that doesn't really tell you anything because that I am me but let's say I was to promote this as the creator of this course right the test account is tester so if I go to tester tester which is the person who created the course if I open that up in a new window if some if you if I send that link to you and you go <coughs> to there and you go look at that site at that course and you're like oh I don't know that course isn't really for me but you decide to create an account in Click eCourse and you register 
you're going to end up being referred by tester see referred by test account it says right there right so that allows allows the the site to know who referred the person so that when that person eventually does become a paid member or buys other courses without going to using a special link you get the commission for it right so that's one of the things that uh, you can do on click ecourse that's one of the reasons why you want to host your course on there because it's a bigger picture it's not just about your course it's about anybody who comes into the site through your course through your links they get tied to you so that if they buy anything else or if they get become a member you get a commission every single month from their membership fees and that's one of that's kind of how all that works so like I said it's clickycourse.com you go there you set up your account and then you can create a course now what else can I talk about one of the other things I want to talk about is the social feed if you look at this you can see that there's a feed on here and this feed is like a social like Facebook and you know news feed right so you can see right here that it says test account published a new course it says right there so that means that if you're on the on the platform you've got your own course or maybe you're a student in another course and you're just looking at the feed you're going to see look at that oh cool there's a new course what is that course you can actually click on this it takes you to the course so you can actually look at what the course is about right and you might be oh well and whatever right so now you go back to the feed <coughs> and you go through and you can see other things you can actually put a comment in here you can say hey hey there uh you know what's <coughs> what's <coughs> what's going on today going on today I really I'm I'm let's just do that I'm creating a new blog post and course course income secrets secrets episode we are at number 207 I think is it let's go take a look we're at number 208 208 we're at number 208 now whoops 208 now you can go check it out check it out at so j uh, cis 208.js com. now that won't be active right now but once this is all posted it'll be active. but whenever you watch this or listen to the audio you're going to be able to go to cis208.jsgagnon.com that's where all my course income secrets go they go to cis with the number .jsgagnon.com and in the uh, uh, post a new update that I'm doing on the news feed right now I'm going to just put a link here click on this I'm going to post this like that I'm going to say open a new target submit so now I just save that hey there doing doing live recording and then I'll just post so now that adds a news update here hey there doing live recording with how's it going on today and then it's got a link right here that shows you what that uh that so that you'll be able to see that in the news feed now the news feed is kind of like Facebook uh, if there's thousands of people posting things you won't necessarily see everything it'll be based on what you like what you don't like we're working on pages and groups right now there's lots of stuff and that's one of the reasons why you want to have your course on Click eCourse because of all this social media like even if I look through here I can actually mouse hold my mouse on this and it'll show me the actual whoops sorry I moused away it'll actually show me the actual account right here the test account and I can click I can send them the, them a message I can click on message right here and then I can just hey tester how's it going right and I can send the message uh and send them a message and have a conversation with them without them without me even knowing their email or anything like that they're not necessarily connected kind of like social media right with Facebook that kind of stuff so it's very similar to that and so that's one of the things is getting the social side of things and uh, you can see right here that this is because I'm the admin of the site there's not like millions of dollars made on the site yet so it's relatively new so this is the time to get in to be in the forefront to be one of the first to have an account to start to promote it and maybe you don't promote it like crazy you just talk to a few of your friends and just say hey I you know I got this site it's 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 a pretty cool course hosting site you should go there get your account set up 
and then you know maybe later in a year from now they're going to decide to become a member and then you will get the commission because you promoted it because you told them right now instead of waiting a year from now because you're like well what if it doesn't work well if it doesn't work it doesn't matter if this doesn't work nothing's going to happen but if it does work you get the commission on whatever you worked on today and you know obviously I think it'll work that's what I'm working towards that's what I spend all my time on so make sure you go and set up your account right now put your course on there put a basic course on there start promoting it start sending people to it and see what they say if they don't like the site well there's a there's a support link right here just click on support right here down the bottom and then you can actually raise a ticket uh, right here's a test it's a test here um actually that was but you can create a new ticket right here actually you can do that right here too if you click on the plus there is a support right there which will take you to a new ticket you can say uh, I'd like I'd like a new feature it's uh, so I'd like to see I don't like how the page layout is right I'd like to see I'd like to see a normal editor so right so you can post something like that if you're not happy with what you see you can actually get support get add get new features added all that stuff it's very complete site you can do all sorts of things and I hope it'll be a site that will really work for you that you're really going to be able to enjoy and you're going to be able to use and it's going to be beneficial to anybody who is trying to host a course online anybody who is lear learning how to use the uh, something online where you can actually promote something you can actually get some uh, income from some of these things you can actually generate your own you know your own income from monthly referrals of people on this site all right hopefully we'll see you in the next episode have yourself a great day until next time this has been Course Income Secrets, the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon, until next time.